New at 5, we have shocking video of what's going on in one of the busiest BART stations in the Bay Area. Several junkies blatantly shooting up out in the open. Others slumped along the corridors. This is San Francisco's Civic Center station. We sent KPI X5's Wilson Walker to ask the mayor and BART, what are you doing about all of this? Open IV drug use, unconscious men and women, piles of vomit on either side of the hallways. This is a morning walk through the Civic Center BART and Muni station. And one more, I just I gotta pull out the camera. I gotta show my friends this. They're not gonna believe it. And over the course of a week, Shannon Gafford documented his trip to work. You may find the video shocking. You may find it routine. Every day, every morning, 5 30, 6 o'clock. It's, I mean, you can see there's dozens of them and needles everywhere, crack, heroin. It's a real concern for our riders and, and we appreciate that. What we have to do is make the most of the resources, the limited resources that we have. Hey guys, we need to clear the stairs. BART, which has been pledging to address these problems, says it's recruiting more community service officers, more than 30 new sworn officers, and 20 new station cleaners. But will that be enough? The situation on our BART stations is simply unacceptable. Borders disastrous. San Francisco Mayor Mark Farrell, who today unveiled a $13 million plan to get needles, among other things, off of city streets. But the city's jurisdiction ends when you head down those BART stairs. Yes, I don't care at the end of the day if now we have jurisdictional issues. As mayor, I want to get something done, and I want to make sure that these BART stations are cleaned up. Now, while homeless services are offered to those in the city's BART stations, the mayor says San Francisco police may be needed because BART admits it is simply overwhelmed by the crisis that has landed in its hallways. We're in the midst of a national homelessness crisis, and we're also in the middle of a national drug crisis. And unfortunately, as a transit agency, we have limited resources, and we're not really equipped to deal with these social issues. So this, for now, is the status quo, a daily commute through a human crisis that shows no end. You do. You feel bad for these people in a way. I mean, because you are human and you see them. This isn't going anywhere, it looks like. It's just getting worse. In San Francisco, Wilson Walker, KPIX 5.